It was quarter final time in the 24th edition of the Gary Weber Open, and there were some intriguing last eight matchups in store for lovers of top notch grass court tennis. First up was the meeting between German golden boy Alexander Zverev and the resurgent Marcus Bagdatis. The two unseeded players slugged it out in an even opening set, with 19 year old Zverev producing moments of brilliance to excite the locals. Done. The first set went to a tie-break, where the Cypriot's drop shot was doing the damage. Again from Bagdatis, brilliant, just brilliant. Having failed on five set points, Bagdatis again couldn't take advantage for the sixth time. No way, that's brilliant again. Zverev wants more. Zverev capitalised and seized the set, with Bagdatis' frustration clear to see. And there was to be no Bagdatis birthday celebration, as Zverev booked his second career ATP 500 semi-final. Game seven Game match, seven match to Zverev. Another wonderful performance from the teenager. The first set decisive in the end, which he managed to pinch 11 points to nine. And look at the respect. Bagdatis full of admiration. Defending champion Roger Federer took on David Goffin for the fifth time, with the Belgian yet to register a victory. And it didn't look about to change, as Goffin struggled to live with the number one seed, with Federer seemingly in a hurry. Oh. Well, that was a gift from Goffin. Federer. The world number three took the opener 6-1 in just 20 minutes, so Goffin decided it was time for all-out attack. Goffin served for the set at 5-4, but fell apart at his big moments. His first double fault of the match. There then came a tie-break of superlative tennis, with both players firing winners at will. Well, Federer didn't exploit Goffin on the forehand coming forwards. He'd had enough of that rally. But it was Federer who came through an epic 15 minute breaker to take down the match. Again, seven match, Federer. It will be an incredible. 12th semi-final at the Gary Faber Open for Roger Federer. Unfortunately, there was to be no repeat of last week's Stuttgart final between Philipp Kohlschreiber and Dominic Thiem, as Kohlschreiber was forced to pull out of their quarter-final owing to a hip strain. The final last eight matchup was another unseeded contest, as Florian Meyer met last year's beaten finalist Andreas Setti. Meyer qualified for the event through his protected ranking after suffering some long absences over the last two years with injuries. But he demonstrated his old class in the opener. Oh, he's made it! After taking the first set tiebreak, Meyer continued to use a grass court game, serving big and backing it up with incredible volume. What a volley! As well as some huge returns. to stand on the brink of a first semi-final appearance in Halle, which he sealed in style. He's made it! Florian Meyer is into the semi-finals here in Halle with a superb performance against last year's losing finalist Andrea Seppi. So we were left with just four men standing at the Gary Weber Open. Roger Federer aiming to make an 11th final in Halle. Alexander Zverev, a first ATP 500 final. Dominic Thiem edging that little closer to a fifth title of the year. And the unseeded Florian Meyer, 